more Vendor Vaughn parts for the SCX6. I've got the full link set and steering link set right here. This includes the panhard bar that I recently broke. Um, no more breaking anymore. None. <laughs> Let's get these things put on the SCX6 and give it a drive. Let's go. Here they are. A thing of beauty. <laughs> they will not break. In a recent video, I did the drive shafts, which are already getting dirty. Um, did the axle gear, so beefing this thing up, and I'm going to have everything Vitavon makes for this. So be ready. I got videos lined up. All right, so to get these started, what we've got to do, we're going to take the wheels and tires off, just uh, you know, make things easy. And then it's just a simple matter of bolt and unbolt. Now, some of these, you kind of got to get them from the inside. So you kind of got to work on those. But yeah, this is, uh, is going to be nice. Hopefully, you found your 10 millimeter wrench to get the wheels and tires off. We're going to start with the front just because there's so much more going on here. We have the tie rod, the, the drag link, the pan hard bar mount, the lower links, which are actually super easy to get. But this link right in here, I gotta drop the transmission so I can get to that bolt right there. And the back, well, that's easy in comparison. So we're gonna get this done. Starting off with the steering. So let's get these opened up, get a good look at them. Pretty obvious, right? This is your drag link, super beefy. This is your tie rod, which goes from knuckle to knuckle. And that's your pan hard, which goes from the chassis to the axle. Super, super beefy here. To put this on, what I want to do is I'm going to take the links loose right here and probably remove the shocks just so I have enough room to move this around. Um, I could probably take the front link off as well, but still, we can work around that. Got to take the pan hard loose here and here, which the shock is directly in the way of that one. And then the steering stuff, that's kind of the easy part. With those out of the way, I have easy access to this and I can get to that as well. And these drive shafts, they have enough slip on them that they'll be good to go. Stock drive shafts will be fine as well. So, but yeah, we get to work. Pan hard is in place. Of course, we're still upside down. Time to put these on. The stock and the Vitavon. Mmm, shiny. Check this out right here, guys. This thing is tight. There is like virtually nothing. No side to side on this. That's awesome. <laughs> really awesome. Now that that's done, it's time to mess with the links. And here they are. Each of these links is labeled exactly where it goes. Nice. And here we are, guys. So uh, I was able to loosen the transmission by the two bolts here, back these a lot of the way out, and I was able to get the bolt loose right there. So uh, not a bad job at all. Are the new Vitavon links heavier or lighter than stock? 141 grams five ounces get these off put these on oh wow we're already at 10 ounces 10.4 ounces right there 296 grams so the Vitavon links are lighter how about that those went on super easy tolerances are great now it's time for the back I'm telling you guys this vehicle has never been this tight before not even fresh out of the box. I mean, it, had, it was way sloppier right out of the box than what it is now. That is awesome. Really awesome. These things are awesome. Oh man. I'm gonna try to not beat them up. I mean, in the dirt's one thing, but uh, on the rocks, I'd rather try to keep them somewhat nice and pristine oh let's go do that again that was fun i moved them around a little bit make things a little bit better <laughs> that is awesome <laughs> oh yeah
about you guys but I'm kind of curious how well does the SEX 6 get around the track gentle <laughs> I'm not gonna hit that that's got a hump and I need to get out not bad you gotta watch the corners Nice. I would love to have a class of these things out here. Wouldn't that be awesome? Everybody showing up with thousand dollar crawlers. Just, well, I say thousand dollars. I mean, like a stock one. <laughs> this would be awesome. Would it be better than X Max's? Nice. Oh, oh no. Oh. Ha 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 ha. Well guys, what do you think? Those links tighten things up. There was one link I took it off, had it sitting over on the table, and uh I was like there's a ball in front of me, like the link in ball, like sitting right there. I'm like, so my links were so loose the balls were literally falling out of the cups. These will not fall out. Okay, these were a lot tighter. Um, this truck is tighter than it has ever been. Like I said, even tighter than brand new out of the box. Um, huge upgrade. Um, the links did hit, the uh, pipes did hit it um, a few times pretty well. Um, they are as straight as they were when I opened them up. Brand new straight. So yeah, happy with that. They are 7075, and that's a really good metal. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, hopefully you liked the video. Check that description. I will put links to all this stuff down there. Make sure you guys check that out. Um, Vitavon is just knocking it out of the park with this thing. And I'm going to have all of the Vitavon stuff on this at some point. Anyway, guys, check that description. Use those links. Make sure you're subscribed. Give it a big thumbs up. And thank you all for watching. Guys, if you like what you see, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and ring that bell. So, in the description, there's a link to become a channel member. If you want to become a channel member, it's a very simple $2, $5, $10, or if you really got some money, $25 a month. It's a simple way to support the channel. So, get that, and I am doing monthly giveaways for members only, so you might want to consider it. So, guys, use those links. Make sure you subscribe. Thank you all for watching.